Hello, this is Raina with Lilo Crafts coming on today as part of a Valentine's collaboration. And I'm so excited to um, be a part of it. It is being hosted by um, North Carolina Mountain Mama, Stephanie. And there are 12 incredible ladies and crafters that are participating in it. And so um, what we were challenged to do was to alter a Dollar Tree mailbox. So I'm going to show you that, but there is also a giveaway um, uh, associated with this. So um, before I do that, just wanted to update you really quickly as to why I haven't been around at all for two weeks. I actually was diagnosed with COVID and um, I'm now COVID free, um, but I am just... Um, starting to recover. I've actually been sick for 14 days. So it really hit me hard and my husband too. So um, everybody who was praying for me and sent me messages, I really appreciate it. So let me show you the items that I use to, um, to go ahead and make my um, mailbox. So the first thing we started off with was um, a, a Dollar Tree uh, mailbox. So just one like this. And then um, the items I used to alter it were just some plain pink paper. Um, I used, I'm trying to use the stuff that's in my stash. So, um, so I had some of this pink deco mesh. I also had this iridescent. And um, because I'm using it to coordinate with my tree, I'm, I'm using more of this tinsel garland that I've been using on some of my Valentine's projects. And then I'm using some of this vase filler that I got um, on sale for 74 cents at Hobby Lobby on clearance a while ago. I'm utilizing a straw and um, I'm utilizing um, this word love as a cutout. I got this from Hobby Lobby um, this year and I'm using a cool temperature glue gun. Okay, so let me clear this off and I'll show you what I made. Okay, so here is my mailbox and you can see that I used um, the love and the straw to make like the flag so that the um, people would know that there is um, some love notes in the mail. And moving on down, you can see I covered the uh, mailbox with um, pale pink paper. And okay, um, so I used um, iridescent mesh to um, make stripes in between the lines. And then I um, cut the vase filler in half and uh, used that because everything I think needs a little bit of glitter. And then I made a heart out of the pink deco mesh to accent the side of it. And then um, coming on down, I um, have a uh, pink and white polka dot bow with a uh, bling heart center. And I put this on top of a candle holder um, that I got from the Dollar Tree, a ceramic candle holder. And then as you see over here, um, this is actually a, um, a heart filled with foam roses and um, the bottom is covered the same way with the iridescent deco mesh and those um, foam balls. And then I use this uh, um, fluffy trim around the edges. And then inside I have three little love notes um, inside of my um, mailbox. And so I do have a tutorial on how to make um, little love notes as well. So this is my sweet little mailbox. I like how it turned out. It's my first time altering a mailbox. So um, uh, let me tell you a little bit about the giveaway now. Um, so the giveaway is open uh, to anyone who is 18 or older. And um, for my giveaway, you can be in the US or you can be international. If you are um, international, you will receive a PayPal um, transfer of $10. Or if you are in the US, you'll get a $10 Dollar Tree gift card. Or if you would prefer the $10 on a PayPal transfer I would, or Venmo, I would be happy to do that as well. Um, you must, uh, oh, 
YouTube and Dollar Tree have nothing to do with this. Um, all of the channels are hosting a giveaway. So all the giveaways are different. But in order to participate in the giveaways, um, you've got to comment on the video um, for me and then also be subscribed, publicly subscribed to every channel to be able to enter the giveaways. So um, I hope you will go and check out the other incredible makers and subscribe to their channels if you aren't familiar with them yet. And um, I'm also going to tie this in as part of my Saturday morning makes project since this is the very first time I've been crafting in over two weeks. So um, I hope you have an amazing day. Thank you.